Hello everyone, this is Fred. I find out that there is a good way to combine Obsidian workflow with Microsoft PowerPoint. With this tool, you can easily form up your presentation slides by using Obsidian. First of all, we have to install the Obsidian Pandas plugin, and then we have to install Homebrew in our Mac. With Homebrew, we can install Pandas. After all this installation, I will introduce the format of how to form a simple document in PowerPoint using Obsidian. I will also share the example file with you. Okay, let's dive in. Okay, so first we start our Obsidian. Go to Settings, Community Plugins. Remember to turn off the Save Mode. Now browse. We can search Obsidian and Duck. Okay, because I already installed it. You can install here. Then close. Close. Next step, start our browser and uh, you can go to a link, I put it in the information part. This is uh, where you can download Pandas. You can download the latest installer here, but I prefer using the homebrew. You can install Pandas using homebrew. By pressing command and click. You can go to the installation page and paste that in Mac OS terminal or Linux shell prompt. Okay, so I copy that because I'm using Alfred, so I can directly paste this inside here, and then you will run the command in terminal. Okay, close it. After you install the homebrew. Actually, it takes some while, and then you can install Pandas by type this into your command. And next, I suggest you to also install here. Um, install other software that integrates with Pandas. For example, to install Lib SVG, Python, and Basic Text. After this two installation, we can go back to our Obsidian. Here is one more settings we need to set up. So please go to the settings and the Pandas plugin. You can see the options here. If there is a red line, say you have to um, assign the Pandas path. Please come here, the Pandas path part, and then originally you will be empty here. And then go to the terminal and please type which Pandas, and then copy the location of your Pandas file, and then paste it here. And restart your Obsidian again. After restarting it, this is the example file I already done here. Now we can press Command P to call out one command. So we type panda export as PowerPoint. So, it will automatically generate a file with your file name. Create a PowerPoint file for you. Let me show you. Okay. So, as you can see, the first page is the useless YAML area. With three hyphen, you can use it like this. Second, 
This is the title of the table. By using this separation here, you can have the title head. And then this is the content. Next, this is the one page title with your he headings number one. Okay, and then the fourth part. You will ignore the taggings. And if you don't have empty line, you will automatically only have one space here. And uh, if you have a empty line, this will be the correct result to go to another next line. Okay. Here's the point two. Point two, actually you create an individual title in a page if you use heading 1 and uh, heading 2 means your inside title then as you can see I have the checkbox here it will show up also in your PowerPoint slides also can do with all the listing number listing bullet listing okay. the third one is the page title and you can also create the table head inside obsidian okay. so point three point three is it will ignore the heading three heading four heading five be all the same inside PowerPoint. Okay. In point four, I show you another way to create table. So basically, separation, title head, content, and this you will have title head, table head. Okay, this is some sharing of how you can combine Obsidian and the PowerPoint workflow. Thank you. See you next time.